The work itself, painted in the last year of Renoir's life, is a fine example of his later landscapes. As early as 1910, Renoir was suffering from severe arthritis. Despite searing pains in his joints, Renoir continued to paint, sometimes requiring a paintbrush to be tied to his hand because he could not otherwise hold it. This would have been one of his last works that Renoir completed before his death. She made a claim for the work. After an investigation by my office and the FBI, the purported owner of the work voluntarily agreed to relinquish its claim to the Dufam, and as a result, we are able to return the painting to Madame Sulitzer today. And I'm very thankful to be able to show my beloved family wherever they are, that after all what they've been through, there is a justice. Nazis attempted to dehumanize and destroy the Jewish people, and we remember the Holocaust as a history of individuals, and this in and of itself is an act of resistance. From the most unjust of times, a measure of justice is restored today.